Hello, how are you? Yeah, I'm great. Hello. <laughs> yes, I'm good too. So um, my name is James. I'm from New York. What's your name? Where are you from? Yeah, I'm from South Korea. My name is Ari. Oh, oh, you have a cool name. <laughs> Thank you kindly. Thank you kindly. Thank you kindly. So is this the lesson that you're working on? Yes. <laughs> All right, cool. Activities and interests raising children. All right, very good. Let's see. Mm -hmm. All right, so we're going to work on reading, extracurricular activities, vocabulary yeah. review, discussion questions, and talking about sensitive topics. All right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, good. So let's get started. These are just, just some questions to get us warmed up. What extracurricular activities do your kids do? Oh, my kids, uh, my kids have uh, English, English as extracurricular activity. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And and do you think extracurricular activities are important for kids? Why? Why not? Oh yeah, mm, nowadays all. All, all around the world uh, connected uh, online. So mm -hmm, mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. English is uh, the most important, uh, important uh, English uh, language. I think language. So. Yes, language. Yeah. Yes, yes. Yeah. I, you know, you know, I didn't know that until I started working here at Cambly. I didn't know how important English was around the world mm -hmm. until I started working here and started helping people to develop their English. Yeah, um, yeah. My kids, I mean, here in the U.S., mm -hmm. English is our first language, so we're not we're not required. Well, we don't have to develop a second language, you mm -hmm. know, as much as other people in other countries have to. Yeah, because yeah. everyone is trying to learn English. I think mm -hmm. it makes us lazy. You know, to some respect, it makes us a little lazy because we don't ever have to learn someone else's language. Yeah. And everything. Everyone else learns another language. They sometimes they're learning three languages. You know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Actually, uh, I'm I'm jealous of you guys because you have to. Uh, you you don't have to. Uh, uh, effort to learn learn other languages. Mm, no, I. You know what? You know what? I think you guys are better off. <laughs> I, I think I think the to I think I think you guys are better off because mm -hmm. having having the discipline to learn another language. Yeah, is something is something that many Americans don't have. Mm -hmm. You know. Mm -hmm. That um, in, and when you learn another language, you mm -hmm. learn another culture. Yes, you yes, know, exactly. because yeah. language, language and culture are so so connected. You know, mm -hmm. so yeah. for many Americans, especially if they don't travel, you know, all they know is American culture. They never yeah. know about South Korean culture or, mm -hmm. you know, or French culture or mm -hmm. Mexican culture. Yes. Because we don't learn the language and we don't dive into it. So I think we miss out. Whereas you're developing yourself and learning about more people, developing yourself and your own culture in the, in, in the same in the same way, that you guys actually are better off than we are in this respect. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, I think so. Yeah. Extracurricular activities. Practice reading the passage aloud. Stop mm -hmm. and review any words that are unfamiliar yeah. or difficult to pronounce. Yes. So go ahead. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No problem. <laughs> yeah. Many kids are in, in developed in extracurricular activities. Involved. 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 Yes. Involved. Involved in extracurricular activities. Kids mm -hmm. might pra practice practice pick, practice picate. You you were you were you were like so right there. Participate. Uh, participate yes. in a mm -hmm. sport in a sport. 
take yes. lessons or join a club because they are passionate about that activity. Par parents might mm -hmm. also sign their kids up for extracurricular activities to help them get crazy uh, school scholarships scholarships or to help mm -hmm. them wear rounded people yeah so i'll how much of that did you understand yeah did you I understand did. the whole thing yeah uh yeah almost things yeah. okay so I'll, I'll i'll read it back to you just to get the the for the pronunciation then many kids are involved in extracurricular activities kids might participate in a sport take lessons or join a club because they are passionate about that activity parents might also sign their kids up for extracurricular activities to help them get college scholarships or to help them be well-rounded people okay. all right so why might kids choose an extracurricular activity why? Why would they choose something like this? Hmm. Uh, they, my kids, want to uh, want to more uh, more new world. More uh, my my kids want to explore experience. Uh, my kids want to explore new world. Ah, so mm -hmm. you you went through a few words that could apply. You went through yeah. your kids could experience or mm -hmm. your kids want to experience, your kids want to explore. Yeah. And either, either one of those could have worked very well, depending mm -hmm. on what you said afterwards. So what you what you said in that last sentence worked very good. My kids want to explore new words. Or you yeah. can say, my kids want to experience new words. They want mm -hmm. to experience um, new ways to communicate. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, and and the uh, and the most uh, my kids um, my kids love to um, love reading books, uh, mm. reading books, uh, and almost a re almost a good book is. Uh, written written by english mm. yeah we have we have a uh, we have a almost about about 300 300 of english books really wow yeah. wow that's very good that's very yeah. good so your kids love to read Mm -hmm. and your kids love to read English books. Mm -hmm, yeah. um, you have a lot of English books. You have 300 English books. Mm -hmm, yeah. mm -hmm. Very good, very good. Why might parents sign their kids up for extracurricular activities? Mm -hmm. um, almost two parents uh, give, want to give, want to give, Mm, want to give want to give give key uh, their kids to have a good life good mm. life mm. <clears throat> parents want to give their kids a good life yeah and uh, and, uh, and they they would be a uh, day we have uh, they they uh, parents want to want to to their want to their kids to have uh, to have a good job mm, yes mm -hmm. parents <clears throat> excuse me parents want to give their kids the opportunity to have a good life parents want to give their kids a chance to get a good job yeah mm -hmm. yeah very good very good and you're absolutely right on both of those by the way i have kids myself but they're still very young mm -hmm. but we give them extracurricular activities too my mm -hmm. son is five years old wow same. Realize, yeah. 
Oh, I really? Have, yeah. yeah. I have. Uh, mm -hmm. My oldest son is five years old, and little baby is uh, three years old now. Mm, my daughter is four. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Yeah, uh -huh. my son is five. My daughter is four, and we feel, you know, we we felt that school wasn't enough. Uh -huh. You know what they were getting at school wasn't enough, so we gave them, you know, we we signed them up for extra learning. Mm -hmm. you know so that they will always you know be ahead you know of yeah. of um of what they're doing in school mm -hmm. and everything and um if if they're ahead then they'll always have an easier time in school they won't be they won't struggle yeah. you know um when i when i was growing up mm -hmm. i struggled mm -hmm. and yeah. everything i struggled in everything you know and i had a i was always playing catch up Mm -hmm. you know, with school. So I didn't want that for my kids. I wanted them to have a better life. I yeah. wanted them to have an opportunity for a better life. Yeah, yeah better life. Good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, very good. Very good. Very good. Mm -hmm. Vocabulary review. Mm -hmm. Review these terms. And the next slides um, contain practice activities. Yeah. All right. Yes. So I'll re what I'll do is I'll repeat and I'll, I'll say it and then you repeat. Okay. Okay. To participate. To participate. To, to take part in an activity. To take a part. Uh, to take a part in an activity. Right. Passionate. Passionate. Mm -hmm. Having strong feelings of enthusiasm for something. Having strong feelings of enthusiasm for uh -huh. something. Ha mm -hmm. uh, having strong feelings of in a two, in, uh, enthusiasm, in enthusiasm, oh, in a enthusiasm, enthusiasm, enthusiasm ah. for something. <laughs> very good, very good, very good. That's not a that's a hard word. That's a yeah. hard word. <laughs> it's, too, it's, it's too hard. <laughs> mm -hmm. To sign up. To sign up. To arrange to do something by adding your name to a list of people doing that thing. Mm -hmm. To arrange it to do something by adding your name to a list of people doing that thing. Very good. Mm -hmm. All right. Scholarship. 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 Mm -hmm. Money awarded to a student to help them pay for their education money awarded a student to help them pay for their education very good very good well rounded well rounded mm -hmm. having a variety of experiences and skills Having a variety of experience and skills. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Over scheduled. Over scheduled. Mm -hmm. Having such a busy schedule that you feel overwhelmed. Having a, uh, having such a busy schedule that you feel over overwhelmed. Overwhelmed. Well. Overwhelmed. Overwhelmed. Well. There you go. There you go. Downtime. Downtime. Mm -hmm. Time when someone relaxes. Time when someone relaxes. Yeah. Take it easy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So did you understand all of these words and the meanings? Yeah, I understand all of them. Oh, very good. Because I, uh, before this lesson, I, mm -hmm. I study uh, these new words. <laughs> <laughs> very good. Very good. Yeah. Very good. <laughs> wow. <All right. laughs> very good. Very good. Very good. I love it. I love it. All right. So match the words to their synonyms. Yes. Um, there may be more than one match per word. Okay. Mm -hmm. So yeah. like in this, in this example, participate is to take part in and to join um, in. They mean, yeah. they mean the same thing. All right. Mm -hmm. Yes. So what about this one, passionate? Passionate. Mm -hmm. Passionate. Too busy. 
Mm. Let's see. In, uh, ready to keep on, keep on, free time, join. Wild, wild about, wild about. Mm. Yes, wild, wild about. about. Mm -hmm. Yeah, wild that's about. A, that's a yes, there you go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm passionate in English now. Yes, very mm -hmm. good, very good, very good. Yes. And there's another one, really into. Mm -hmm. really, really into. Mm -hmm. I am really into learning English uh -huh. right now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yes. same thing. Mm -hmm. Same thing. All right. Um, you can also say, you can also say keen on. Mm -hmm. Keen on. I am really keen on learning English right now. Mm -hmm. They all mean the same thing. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Keen on. Sign up for. Sign up for enroll. I enrolled mm -hmm, on Cambridge. Mm -hmm. Yep, um, very good. Yeah, joining. I'm yes, joining. very good, very good, very good, very good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And enroll. Downtime. 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 Free time. Free time. Mm -hmm. Yep, very good, very good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. And over scheduled too busy over scheduled yes absolutely mm -hmm. absolutely all right very good on that okay all right use your imagination what do you think is happening in this photo use the vocabulary below to tell an imaginary story about this child and his parents mm -hmm. as an example sign up his parents signed him up for piano lessons. Mm -hmm. Now you can go. You can mm -hmm. you can start with this one if you have it something different, or you can do this one if you want. Uh, yes, in barb in barb the in. Mm -hmm. Yes, let me uh, let me make a sentence now. Sure. Mm -hmm. And you can always ask me to go first if you want to. Yeah, my my uh, he is involved in piano. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he is involved in piano or taking involved. piano lessons. Uh, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, piano lessons. very good. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He were, uh, uh, he is passionate, passionate mm. uh, in piano lesson. Yeah, he is very passionate about his piano lessons. He is very passionate uh, yeah. about, about his about, piano lessons. Yes, he is very passionate about uh, about his, his. piano lessons. His. Right. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well rounded. Mm -hmm. Well rounded. Oh yeah, he he is well rounded kid. Yeah, or oh, he is a he is a well rounded he is a kid. Well rounded kid. Yes. Yeah. So I'll I'll also do these as well. Just for another example, I'll mm -hmm. start with um with sign up. Um, my son came to me and said he wanted to sign up for piano lessons. Mm -hmm. He is very involved in taking piano lessons at school. My son is so passionate about music. Taking piano lessons will make him a more well-rounded student. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Ah, read and discuss. Extracurricular activities have many benefits, but it's easy for family families to become overscheduled, which can exhaust kids and their parents. It can also mean kids have less downtime at home. Mm -hmm. In your opinion, how many extracurricular activities should kids participate in at different ages? Part Participate. 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 Mm -hmm. How many? 
one, one. Uh, one or two. Yeah, yeah, I think so too. You know, especially at the ages that our kids are 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 at right now. You know, not too many. You know, and it shouldn't be for too long and everything. You know, but one or two during the week, I think, is fine. As kids get older, you yeah. know, I think you can add more as long as they're comfortable. You know, mm -hmm. and they still have some downtime to just be by themselves or to do the things that they want to do. You know, so that they develop something on their own. You know, mm -hmm. just yeah. um, just to relax. What do your kids like to do in their downtime? Mm. Oh, they they want uh, they like to play play game or mm -hmm. game or watching YouTube. Mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. My kids like to play games too. And yeah. um, they like to, there, there's this thing called, um, there's this thing called PBS Kids here mm -hmm. in the US. And mm -hmm. um, it has, it has games that teach them about animals and, you know, conservation and things like that at, at their level. And they mm -hmm. love to do those things too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I, um, I, uh, I say, um, if my, uh, if my kids, too, uh, kids watching on YouTube too much, I say, I say, you should, you should watch only educational app. <laughs> mm, yes, 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 yes. And even even when they're on, you know, for that, I usually give them one hour and everything uh -huh. of that. And then they have to go do something else, whatever it is they want to do, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> do something else. <laughs> sometimes, uh, sometimes no matter what they watch uh, on YouTube uh, for all day long. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same here. Same here. <laughs> if we let them, then they'll watch it all day long. They'll watch TV. Mm -hmm. They'll be on the computer all day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see. Ah, so kids or their parents may dream of turning their extracurricular activity into a career someday. Mm -hmm. Pursuing this dream means a huge commitment for families. Yeah. If your kid wanted to follow this dream, how would you feel about it? How much time and money would you spend? Mm. Oh. Uh, if I, if I, mm, if I can, if I can do, if I can to help my kids, uh, until they grow up, I mm -hmm. will, I will have to, I will have to uh, study and learn. Mm -hmm. I, I will, mm -hmm. I will help them to learn and study. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. So if your kids came to you with their dream, mm -hmm. you would help them to learn and study and, and, and know more about it. Mm -hmm. yeah. Very good. Very good. Um, and do you think it's better to be excellent at one activity or good at several activities and why? Oh, I think uh, several activity is uh, better than one activity, but um, extra activity is uh, spent uh, mm, uh, cost uh, a lot of money. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> so I mm, I need to just do one ex one extra uh, one extra. Mm -hmm. I, yeah, mm -hmm. yes. yeah, so, um, you know, being, being good at several activities is, is better, but 
um, doing one thing can be very expensive. Um, so I think, you know, for me, um, if my kid came to me with their dream, I would definitely help them to pursue it. You know, I would help them to develop it and grow it for as mm -hmm. long as they wanted to. Yeah. Um, the money part, I would, um, I would, I would try to make it as cost friendly as possible. Yeah. Because yeah. You, you don't want to, you know, put all this money into something and then they say, oh, I don't want to do it anymore and everything, you know, because that can happen. Um, but I would still let them pursue it you know, as much as I can. Mm -hmm. And um, I also think it's better to do several activities mm -hmm. or to be good at several activities, because if one thing doesn't work, then you can try something else, uh -huh. you know? Yeah. Um, being, being excellent at one thing means that that's all you can do. However, you know, it's like, it's like um, you can earn more money. Mm -hmm. You know, you can you can pursue higher um, higher levels in that, mm -hmm. like like when you get your your doctorate degree, you mm -hmm. know, when yeah. you go to school and you get you you get your bachelor's, you get your master's, and then you get your doctorate. Mm -hmm. You're 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 specializing in one thing, and you can earn a lot of money doing that. You mm -hmm. know, if it's the right thing, mm -hmm. you know. But if you do various things, then you have a chance to make money and to live a good life doing different things so that if the world changes mm -hmm. and now what you do doesn't matter as much anymore, then yeah, you can yeah. try something else and make money mm -hmm. in that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I agree yeah. with you on that. Yeah, ordinary like you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. What about you? When your child wants to quit an extracurricular activity, do you let them? What factors do you consider when making the decision? Mm. Our kids are young, but I think it still yeah. applies sometimes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. They always want to quit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, recently, my kids are very young, like, mm -hmm. likewise you. But mm -hmm. so, yeah. Uh, Particular, uh, particularly, uh, just one, uh, just one extra curricular is enough. I think so. Yeah, yeah. yeah. If if my yeah, if, go ahead, go ahead. Mm -hmm. Last last of uh, things are, I can help them by myself. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, drawing, right? for example, yes. drawing and uh, mm -hmm, making, mm -hmm. making something, and uh, reading books is, uh, I, uh, and uh, reading English books can help them. Yes, uh, yes. By myself, yeah. Mm -hmm, yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm the same way. I think. Um, you know, I, I, I want them to try. Mm -hmm. I always, I, I, I'm always telling my kids when they want to quit, yeah. you know, or when they feel like they can't do something, I say, you know, daddy only wants you to try. Mm -hmm. If you yeah. try and you don't, and you fail, then that's okay. But if you don't ever try, then you'll never know if you're going to be good at it, you know? So I'm always telling them, especially my son, because I want him to develop an idea inside that mm -hmm. says, I can do it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can do it, you know? But if he really wants to quit and he just doesn't want to do it, then I'm, I'm, I'm okay. I let him. But after he, you know, at least puts in an effort to try. And if he still doesn't want to do it, then I say, okay, let's try something else. And maybe we'll come back to it later or then revisit it or or whatever. But um I don't I don't like to to force him and you know to do it if he mm -hmm. really, really doesn't want to do it and everything. I let him, yeah. you know, I totally to agree him. with you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They should try and everything. Oh man, we have 20 seconds wow. and everything. Well, Ellie, this was great. Was your lesson was fantastic and uh, useful <laughs> to me. 
for me. Oh, very yeah. good, very good, very good, very good, very good. You know, then hopefully I'll see you next time. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Bye bye. <laughs> see you next time. Bye bye. Yep. See ya. Yeah.